Does anybody else miss a slow day in the world of cryptocurrency? And my other question is, who exactly is Elon Musk trolling at this point? I am become meme destroyer of shorts. Uh, I mean, it goes on and on. Everything that he does here is just low-key, low-key, taking everything as a joke, pumping doge. Honestly, like who in their right mind would pump Doge? I mean, I'm sure it's a very convenient pump and dump for people who are into that sort of thing. But when it comes to cryptocurrency and these different markets, it's like, although I am a person who exists on the Internet and I feel very exposed to a lot of this different stuff, it somewhat goes across as arbitrary to hop on this like GME stuff. I think that Bitcoin Digibyte and the fundamentals are easier to stick to than uh, trying to hop on the bandwagon of things that although you might think that, and you might actually have been right but it's just too much uh, effort to pay attention to these meme sort of things uh, due to their unpredictability and the it's I suppose it's the one of the things that limit you of being intelligent i mean if you're a smart person then it, it basically limits your ability to get involved with things that are sort of uh you know require a bit of that blind faith sort of thing and at one point bitcoin posited that and it's interesting to see how the quote-unquote rational people have been made so irrational uh, especially in the current paradigm shift that we've been seeing but i especially with the recent malleability that we've seen in terms of the markets and all these things i think that people are starting to come around to my perspective on my long-term predictions that i put out and i've never actually once apologized for any of the predictions that I've made because I still stand by my reasoning at the time and everybody's wrong sometimes and everybody's right sometimes and when we're in this space and we're making these speculations all we can really do is give our opinion and provide a disclaimer but I see the one dollar digibyte is still well within possibility especially with the movements that we've been seeing happening with bitcoin the entire narrative on it has changed um that definitely some intra you know in interesting intense things that have been happening um and uh definitely people honestly i think i'm suspicious about doge though i think that it definitely is trying to get people away from um bitcoin getting people to invest their money in doge is kind of one of the biggest jokes it's a waste of money i mean uh, i mean i mean obviously if they're just trading but a lot of these people who are quote unquote investing in doge aren't necessarily big uh i would imagine aren't really traders if they're just using a robin hood app or something like that so all these different aspects need to be taken into consideration and i just count myself lucky to be in the digibyte community with such a great community you know such a great um, plethora of knowledge and you know an awesome supportive community that's really doge of course does have its own community but it's more of a uh, it's not serious uh, about um these not not knocking doge either you know i wouldn't knock anybody's cryptocurrency dream maybe it will go um, to 10 cents and stuff like that. But I see um, Digibyte is actually having real world application, um, you know, decentralized application, secure authentication, um, you know, seven years, it's a UTXO blockchain, cuts down on fees. And we're actually talking about true decentralization. Uh, it's really a no brainer. So it will be interesting to see how uh, the different paradigm shifts that are currently uh, manifesting themselves um, in the public consciousness sort of coalesce and will ultimately boil down to um, the, you know the, the determining factor that I suppose just lies uh, just beyond uh, the end of history uh, and that's my perspective on what's currently going on in the general world and how that ties into a potential um, digibyte one dollar uh, evaluation uh, in a long and over a long enough time frame I've always stood by the concept that um, if cryptocurrencies are left alone left up to their own devices the uh, markets can act uh, accordingly if, if allowed to be healthy um, then it, you know the, the all that sort of logic there's a clear path uh, right there that I could see being fleshed out uh, all that being said I hope you guys have enjoyed this video remember this is for entertainment educational purposes only you know, I'm not your dad. I'm not your financial advisor. Um, this video uh, is for entertainment educational purposes only. I'll see you guys in the next one. Make sure that you subscribe and comment down below letting us know what you guys think about the cryptocurrency space and where you expect it to go in the near future with characters like Elon Musk and now there being celebrities. Uh, I really do miss the slow news days in the world of cryptocurrency, but slow news days in general seem to be 
gone by the wayside, it appears. Uh, so this is sort of the world that we're dealing with. Have a good one. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Okay.